गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स वी आर वंस अगेन बैक इन अ वीडियो लेक्चर फॉर क्लास टेंथ आई एम महेंद्र कुमार फैकल्टी ऑफ मॉडल ट्रजी स्कूल फॉर अकाउंट्स एंड इंग्लिश पी जी टी चिल्ड्रेन टूडे वी विल बी डूइंग इन अ रिविजन इन अ वीडियो लेक्चर अ पोएम फर्स्ट पोएम फ्रॉम अ टेक्स्ट एंड नेम ऑफ द पोएम इज डस्ट ऑफ स्नो दो द पोएम इज वेरी स्मॉल इट्स it is just of 18 lines the poem is just of 18 lines not 18 lines sorry it is of 8 lines and the poem of 8 lines is known as octave okay so dust of snow is a very small and simple poem with deep meaning okay it expresses the significance of small things in changing one's attitude how small things help us how they can help us in changing our attitude the poem explains that the little thing in life can make huge changes in our future it also reflects that hard times in the life will lead to the happier time if we can persist with it means वो हिंदी में कहते हैं हर रात के बाद सुबह होती है सो डोंट थिंक दैट थ्रू आउट द लाइफ यू विल बी फेसिंग दैट सैड फेस ऑफ योर लाइफ दे विल बी टाइम्स वेन हैपीनेस विल बी टचिंग यू हैपीनेस विल बी देयर इन योर लाइफ सो लेट्स रीड द पोएम एंड फाइंड आउट व्हाट द पोएम पोएट वांट्स टू एक्सप्रेस थ्रू दिस पोएम The way a crow shook down on me, the dust of snow, from a hemlock tree. So the poet was sad, and he recounts a small incident that changes his mood. It seems very simple, but it has a great significance. Means he remembers certain incident what happened to him. The poet was once very depressed. He recalls one incident and he tells us. that once he was very very depressed and hopeless totally dejected no hope no hope from anywhere he was in a state of sorrow and was lost in his thoughts he was standing under the hemlock tree suddenly a crow that was sitting on the tree shook the tree and the fine particles of snow from the tree fell on the poet now some believe that the crow was already sitting on the tree and it moved and because of his movement the snow accumulated on that branch of the tree or you can say the dust particles accumulated it fell on the poet and some say the crow comes and perches on the tree and that very instant the dust of snow falls on the poet so there are various views some say the crow was already sitting and some say the crow comes and perches on the tree so both the views are correct okay so what happened the name of the tree was hemlock now hemlock is a tree which is a poisonous tree it has small white flowers okay and that tree has some the root of the tree is used to make intoxicated drinks okay so now what happened has given my heart a change of mood now as and when the snow fall on that poet dust particles of the snow fall on that poet he quickly changed his mood before he was very dejected very very sad he was in hopeless situation but now the snow particles helped him to change his mood has given my heart a change of mood and saved some part of a day i had rude rude means regret held in regret wasted half of the day of his was already wasted in thinking about certain things but at least he was able to save other half of the day so when the soft and cold snow fell on the poet it changed his mood from the state of sadness to happiness he started feeling peaceful and refreshed now this simple incident helped him to enjoy the remaining part of the day he thus became happy and 
it saved his rest of the day from being wasted which he was previously he was in regret he was very very sad so i think children you must have understood the motto of the poem k life is full of changes it cannot be stagnant it cannot be constant so you have to accept every phase of life with a challenge this is the motive of the poem okay the poetic device of the poem is irony the rhyming scheme is abab okay thank you children i hope you must have understood the poem thank you and take care